Yeah, exactly. Well, the last day I was hurting. I got to the first mile and I was like, it's the easiest thing I've ever done. And by the time I hit two miles, I was like, am I going to finish? Um, but yeah, I mean, really the last K was about just staying in contact. Lalo got about 10 meters on us, maybe. And that was a little bit scary. So I tried to just go through the gears one at a time. We got into the final shoot. I kind of took the lead coming off that turn All and just right, we tried to drive it home. And what does it mean to win a race like this early Chesley. in the season? Oh, it's Fort amazing. Um, I mean, the atmosphere here, you can't beat it. Uh, my neighbor actually was the top American at Boston in like the 70s or 80s, and he's here. So it's cool to have like a kind of full circle moment, but um, yeah, I mean, just, just happy to be here, really. Job. Thank you. Appreciate it. That is unofficially a new event. Yeah, um, I was telling them, like, just came back down from altitude. We're in such a base period. Like, we've done tempos and, like, maybe some 150s and hills. So I didn't, I had no clue where I was at going into this. And to be able to do that and have the codes I did and, like, just cover moves like that, it's awesome. And there's a lot of work to be done, but. This is a good way to kick off the outdoor season in a big year. Drew was coming off a big ten a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, everyone's strong right now. I think everyone's kind of in the same spot where they're doing base. They can cover moves, but we did, we did like a sneaky workout on Tuesday. Had like a 23 second two on the end. So I was like, get, get to the end and drive it home. So, feeling good. Uh, I'll do some pacing next weekend, and then the following again, I'll do a 1500. Sweet. Thank you. Thank you.